Close your eyes and bring your mind right into the middle, right here where the breath is coming in going out. And try to make this spot your spot of normalcy. In other words, when the mind is not being disturbed by anything, it should come back here. This would be the Buddhist definition of normalcy, particularly with the precepts. The word sila means not only virtue, but also means your ordinary normal habits. And so the Buddha's normal habits are, of course, the five precepts to begin with. And then bringing the mind into a state of normalcy where it's not stirred up by greed, aversion, and delusion. Which, as I said, is different from most people's normalcy. Most, for, for most people, greed is normal. Anger is normal. Delusion is very normal. But when the mind's in a state like that, it's agitated. It's kind of find a place where it can sit down and be at ease. Because the only true happiness is when the mind is at peace. I mean, it's got greed, aversion, and delusion in there. It's not going to be at peace at all. So you want to normal see where happiness is normal, rather than agitation, where peace is normal, rather than disturbance. So you try to create that sense of normalcy here, and then practice coming back, coming back, coming back. So the mind is used to being here. When the mind stays here with a sense of belonging, that this is its spot, this is where it really should be, that's when it can see things a lot more clearly than normal, most people's normal. Which is why when you have issues in life that you're not sure about, it's good to meditate first, get the mind still, get it calm, get it clear. Then think about the issues. For all too many people, they say, well, I can't meditate until this issue is taken care of, until I've resolved this or resolved that. You have to learn how to find a sense of peace even in the midst of unresolved issues. So you can then use that peaceful mind to affect the resolution. So try to make this your normalcy. The mind when it's clear, when it's at ease, balanced here in the present moment. And that way happiness becomes normal. Well-being becomes normal. The mind on the path to the end of suffering becomes normal. <laughs>